Girly games, girly games. We are girls and we play games. Girly games. Squirt. Meow. Hey guys, welcome back to another episode of Unboxing with BMO. We have a super special unboxing for you guys today because it is... It's happening. It's happening. Oh my god. Look at the box. The box is new and pretty. It's got a new logo. Well, not really a new logo, but a new look to the box. Uh, suddenly, comic block. Oh, oh, I can't. Whatever. Uh, suddenly, comic block begins to mutate. This, this is huge, guys. Look at this thing. Look at this thing. It is now officially the same size as the arcade block and all the other lovely blocks, nerd block horror block, etc, etc. It is bigger, but is it better? And I'm not gonna lie, because this is actually, at the same time, it's cool. Uh, but I am wearing this shirt for two reasons. Uh, worst shirt ever. Uh, first reason, because this was the very first shirt that Comic Block had ever had. This was the very first shirt from the very first comic block uh, and I kind of opened this up because I got it two days ago and I didn't have time to do the unboxing so I just wanted to check you know kind of what was in it and second reason I'm wearing this shirt because this shirt isn't the worst t-shirt ever this shirt is the worst t-shirt ever <laughs> and I'm not I'm not lying like I'm not I'm not a Superman fan and I get it it's like Superman and Batman but this shirt to me, and I'm going to show you in two seconds, is hands down the worst shirt I have received in all of my arcade and all of my comic blocks. Hands down. Like, I would put the CSGO shirt before this. I would put so many shirts before this. All the shirts before this. <laughs> this is probably the one shirt I'm just going to instantly donate unless uh, somebody else wants this and they want a giveaway. So I get it as some odd picture of as Clark Kent. It's got his curl or whatever there, uh, and it's kind of supposed to be like the bat symbol, kind of. It's more just like Superman with the cape draped over him. I'm just this shirt does not scream. Let me wear this. Uh, <laughs> so first of all, that's. I honestly this is the probably worst thing in the box. So don't don't get discouraged. The rest of the stuff in the box is pretty awesome. But this hands down worst t-shirt ever. <laughs> worst t-shirt ever, guys. Look at that. This shirt actually is in my top 5 for sure. It's uh I've loved this shirt since the very beginning. And it is an amazing shirt. But that shirt not so great. I don't know. Let me know in the comments, guys. Do you agree with me? Do you not agree with me? Um, one... Here's probably... Well, there's two items that are fighting for my favorite items. Uh, this lovely... Dorbs! Look at the dorbs. Little Wolverine dorbs. Ah! Let's get them out! There we go. <laughs> Got a little Wolverine dorbs. Pull that in front there. No little Wolverine dorbs. Look at that. Get him in front of my face. Little Wolverine dorbs. He's so happy. He's just so happy. I don't know. He's very cute. It's very adorable. I like him. Uh, and then the second item. <gasps> oh, it's Batman. See, I love Batman. Screw Superman. Batman's superior. I haven't seen the movie yet, though. Um, but I probably will. I don't know. Not a bobblehead. Love this. Batman. Looks so cool. I wish you would auto focus. Auto focus, camera. Auto focus on Batman. Auto focus on Batman. <laughs> Anyways, guys. Sweet. Sweet looking Batman. It's pretty awesome. Gray suit. Looking good. It's not Ben Affleck. <laughs> I have nothing against Ben Affleck being Batman. Honestly, he's probably one of the better uh, Batman uh, out there from what I hear. But apparently the movie didn't do so well. So, uh, 
as the circulating sad Batman goes about. Um, so we here have here another Batman themed thing. Uh, it is Mr. J's April Fool's Kit. Let's open this on up. Get the items out of here. We have Freeze's Ice Ice Baby. Uh, oh, oh, it focuses on that. <laughs> so there's uh, two flies in some ice cubes. They're gags, of course. Then we got ourselves a whoopee cushion. <laughs> it's got Harley Quinn on there. Oh. Uh. Drop the bum. Drop the bam. Sweet. <laughs> so that, that's pretty awesome. April Fools. Gotta have something like that in there. I don't know if I would do anything with it. I don't know. Uh, we got a super, I actually think this is super cool, a glow brillo. Uh, it's just a little like sheet decal. It glows in the dark. The guardian of Gotham and the son of Krypton. Batman, Superman. <laughs> While I'm not a fan of Superman, I am a big fan of Batman, and I do enjoy the Justice League. So I will watch Superman-related things if it has to do with the Justice League. That's probably why I will watch uh, the movie, but I really have no interest. Like, I've never seen any of the... Like, I've never gone out to see a Superman movie. If it was on TV and somebody turned it on, I'll watch it. But Justice League intrigues me. Um, but Superman on his own? Me? Um, actually gonna save the three comics for last. There's one more. Yes, and we still have three comics, guys. There's a whole lot of stuff in here. A whole lot of stuff. Alright. And I'm liking this. This print, this is an acceptable print. We have ourselves a lovely Adam West Batman print. Look at that. Some classy, classy shiz right there, guys. I like that. It's a classic Batman. Love it. Oh, that is a beautiful print. Okay, so, along with uh, a noticeable theme of this comic block, we have ourselves Batman and Robin. Sorry. These glares. The actual packaging, I don't know if it's these uh, comics in particular, but the packaging that these comics are in now are actually a lot nicer <laughs> than what they were before. So, Batman, Robin, there's Batman there, that's pretty cool. Uh, features the first chapter of Batman and Robin Born to Kill graphic novel. Oh, that's pretty cool. That doesn't count as a graphic novel though, comic block. Uh, <laughs> I'm sorry. That's the one thing I've been getting a little kind of agitated about lately because I've been waiting almost a year for a graphic novel to show up in this block. They said in the first blocks that it was a possibility you were going to get a graphic novel. Uh, now, if you go on the website to get one of these, you will see a very obvious graphic novel sitting in the image of the comic block. So I would have preferred to actually have seen a graphic novel in this block, and yet I haven't. So I've actually gone onto Twitter and I've asked them, when do you plan on putting in a graphic novel? Because that, come on. You say you're going to put it in there, put it in there. Okay, so our next one is Batman the Dark Knight Returns. Uh, Frank Miller, ooh, with Claus Johnson. Uh, it's a DC Comics Essential. So there we go. It's a nice little cover there. The Dark Knight Returns. Little lightning bolt. Pretty sweet. Um, and this features an, an excerpt from the Batman and Dark Knight Returns. Uh, graphic novel, once again. Just like the last one. Wonder if they're the same or if they're slightly different. Give you two little sneak peeks of that uh, that graphic novel. Put that there. Uh, and last but not least, we have Superman. And it just says Superman. It just has a picture of Superman. And up at the top, it advertises uh, the movie, Dawn of Justice. You can see that. Is it Dawn of Justice? Yeah, that's what it's called. <laughs> Honestly, I probably would have gone to see the movie solely for um, Superwoman. I don't know. Or not Superwoman, sorry. <laughs> Wonder Woman. <laughs> I refuse to watch Supergirl. And they put Flash in it. And now I have to watch Supergirl because Flash is in it. Ugh. <laughs> I don't know if anybody's seen uh, these serials. 
I've seen these cereals. My roommates have purchased these cereals. And I tried them. The Batman one's kind of gross. I just don't really like chocolate with fruit. Um, but the Superman one's pretty good. Even though I don't like Superman, it's okay. I like a cereal. So it's pretty good. Um, so that was everything that was in this a comic block. Now, I'll see if this t-shirt was something, I don't know. Um, Superman, we're not saying you'll... We're not saying you'll be as powerful as Superman when you rock this tee, but you might look just as good as he would in it to see other cool designs. No, no, nobody's looking cool in that t-shirt. I'm sorry. Nobody's looking cool in that t-shirt. It looks pretty stupid. I, just, I don't know. <laughs> like, I've never gotten mad at a t-shirt before, guys. I've always loved all my t-shirts. I love them all. I wear all of them. There's so many t-shirts. I have way too many t-shirts. And I love every single one of them except that one. Except this one. So in fashion, of course, we will go through everything once again. So many things in this block. But we got this alright t-shirt. This t-shirt that's kind of alright. I don't know what to do with this t-shirt. If we, were, if we were to hit, what was I said, 50 subs, uh, I was going to do a giveaway. If you really want this shirt, subscribe. <laughs> and you can wear this shirt. Because I would probably either donate it or give it away. I don't, I'm not going to wear it. <laughs> uh, we got our lovely dwarves. Our lovely dwarves. Wolverine. Love Wolverine. Love the X-Men. Uh, just saw Deadpool. I love those Wolverine jokes. Those are awesome. And that's not, is it a spoiler? No, I don't think it's a spoiler. There really wasn't any spo spoilers. It just kind of made Wolverine jokes in Deadpool. I don't know. <laughs> uh, Batman! Batman. I am Batman. I am Batman. <laughs> I can't do a Batman voice. I, my voice, no. Love Batman, though. Batman's pretty sweet. Freaking love him. The Dark Knight. Uh, we got our Harley Quinn. Oh, it's upside down. Harley Quinn. A little whoopee cushion. I don't know. <laughs> Would I ever use a whoopee cushion? I feel, I've, I've done it in, in my childhood. But would I do it now? I don't know. Perhaps the people at work will have to wait and see. <laughs> uh, along with that, we got these uh, Mr. Freeze ice cubes with the little little flies in them. That's cool. That's pretty cool. You can still use them. You can, they can be Halloween types as well if you don't want to use them as a prank, right? Spooky flies in your stuff. Uh, what else we got here? Oh, we have our lovely Adam West Batman print. Love that. Love it. Glorious. Look at that. It's beautiful. I like prints. I do enjoy the prints. I have my uh, Venom and Carnage prints. They're behind me. You can't see them, but they're beautiful as well. Love getting prints. Uh, we got our little decal. The Batman, Superman. Glow. It glows. It glows in the dark. Well, this side does. That's where it is. You can't. Yeah, yeah you can't even see it. But it's on the back, and it probably does glow. <laughs> Haven't tried it out. We need to have darkness to try it out. And comics. Bring these back over here. Our three comics that we got. Batman and Robin. Pretty sweet. I'm going to enjoy that. I don't know. I feel like that looks really cool. I like I like Robin, but I like Nightwing. Uh, and we got the Dark Knight Returns. Lovely. And we got our Superman comic. Superman. He's kind of super. His eyes glow. But Goku could totally take him. No. Goku could take Superman. Totally. Totally could take Superman. I have many money bets on Goku beating Superman. Goku kicks ass. Superman? Superman's just... Uh, I don't know. I just... Just feel like, you know... You have secret identities. And then you have Clark Kent that just takes his glasses off. and Oh shit, it's Superman. <laughs> like, is everybody around him just humoring him, you know? Like, don't don't let Superman know that we know that he's Clark Kent and that he's just put some glasses on, like <laughs> So yes, that is Superman Su he's Superman. <laughs> Goku's been Superman. 
camera. Uh, oh, and apparently you could have gotten either Batman or Superman uh, for the Funko Pop- Funko, sorry, for the Funko Pops. Uh, blah, blah. So there you go. That's what you could have gotten. Either Superman or Batman. I got Batman. I am grateful to have Batman. Grateful. And it doesn't look like there's anything else of information on the card. And that was it. So that was our first ever upgraded comic block. And honestly, I'm I'm impressed. They give you three comics. They gave us one, what, two, three kind of... I would say I would put these in the more, like, gimmicky type um, items. But still pretty cool items, yeah? So you got your April Fool's. It's pretty relevant, and this looks pretty cool. It glows in the dark. That's awesome. Uh, the print, which is awesome. Like, usually you would just get the three comics and, like, a print or three comics and, like, this thing and your t-shirt, and then that would be it. So that actually adds on a whole lot of stuff because these two vinyls that they gave us, they gave us two of them. They gave us the little dorbs, and they gave us the Batman, and that is awesome. That's just awesome. They gave us two of them. I have no room on my shelves. I'm going to have to make more room for Batman and Dorbs. I'm just going to call them Dorbs. I don't know why. <laughs> I only own one of them, so it's like it's kind of relevant. I like the name Dorbs. <laughs> but then we got this t-shirt, and honestly, I think t-shirts could be hit or miss. Uh, this was a major miss, and not a big deal. Not a big deal. But I want to see a graphic novel, so comic block, please hear me. I want to see a graphic novel in this block. And uh, as for my last episode, I said I wasn't sure as to whether or not I was going to keep going with the block after this one. But you know what? I'm going to keep going at least at least until May's block. Because I want to make it comic block for a year. Uh, I've been there from the very first block, so I want to go up into May uh, and make it a year. And then I will truthfully decide whether or not I keep it. I know for sure I'm keeping my arcade block and I'm about to do that unboxing next and it's going to be so much fun. But still, oh my god, I just can't go over Batman and Dorbs. <laughs> I love vinyl figures. That was awesome that they gave us two. Thank you, Comic Block, for that because that, that to me, made up for the really crappy t-shirt. <laughs> and if again, if you guys don't think that t-shirt's crappy, let me know. Subscribe to the channel. Uh, 50 subs, I'll be doing a giveaway. So... Like, share, subscribe, guys. Bemo out. And go. Oh, hello, Jim. Are you going to die? Oh no, you're not one of those dying ones, are you? <sighs> oh, Steve. I can't even. Why am I doing this? I've had to pee for like days. That's right. I have not peed in more than days. I have not peed in an eternity. Oh, that's actually tragic. Because I have been dead for 70 years. There's a monster. Monster. No monster. Okay, we're fine.